Hey and welcome to my channel and today I'm going to be reviewing Harry Guys which is a bakery in the Scottish Highlands and we have one in Tain and I haven't actually had a Harry Guy in I don't know how long. It's been a while anyway, it's been at least sometime last year and when I say sometime it's probably July, August time. Uh, yeah, quite a long time. So. My order I got in Harry Guys is, I got a sausage roll. Ta-da! Smells so good. And as Daza would do, it's got the crisp. It's crispy. So I got a sausage roll. And I got, which has always been my favorite over here, a dream ring. So whenever I moved from Belfast over here and went into Tea and Royal Academy, on my lunch times I used to get these all the time, dream rings. So it's like a Scottish delicacy up here. It's like a dream ring is elite. Nothing beats a dream ring up here in my opinion. It would be dream ring, apple Danish and a snowball are my three favorites from Harry Guys. And here you have the beautiful dream ring. Have you seen anything more beautiful in your life? Hmm, apart from a burger. <laughs> That's me all over. My heart is connected to my stomach. So yeah. So I got a dream ring and a sausage roll. And it's currently Saturday the 24th and so it's saturday the 24th and today is a big day rugby wise because it's scotland versus england in the six nations rugby so got my scotland rugby shirt on got my tart in come on scotland come on i know this is an old shirt because it has like rugby world cup france 2023 but i love this shirt but anyhow, so that's going to be on, that's on TV. So I will be watching that. And while watching that, I'm going to have my sausage roll. So, but I'm going to put it in the microwave because I like my sausage rolls quite soft. So I'm going to put it in the microwave. And then I'm going to give it a wee try because I haven't had one in so long. and tell you what I think. So yeah, that's the plan. That's my plan, Batman. So, yeah, I'm off to put this in the microwave because the rugby's waiting on me and I think it starts in 15 minutes, 4.45. I think then it's about half four now, but it's not going to take 15 minutes in the microwave for this. So I'm going to put this on. I'm going to consider bread if I've got enough bread left. But yeah, I'm going to put this on. I will see you soon when it's on the plate. So that's my Harry Guy sausage roll out of the microwave, looking all soft and perfect. But I'm gonna add some bread and butter with it because, yeah, I'll want the sausage roll sandwich as well. But yeah, I'm gonna turn it around and you'll see me trying it. So I ended up making bread and butter for it. And yeah, I'm just gonna turn the camera around now and try. So before I try, I'm going to Take a drink of my Highland Spring. Just a clear palette. Highland Spring is leaked. So, that's it. I don't have sauce on at the moment, but I'm running low on sauce. I have that Asda Extra Special sauce, and I have that cheap chip shop brown sauce that I'm not really keen on. And my brown sauce that's in the fridge has barely anything so I'm gonna be using these but yeah now time to try so there you go Okay, 
I need to get more sausage rolls from Harry Guy. And I can feel it warming up my stomach as it goes down. Hmm. The sausage meat is delicious. It's got the right amount of seasoning. Really tasty. The top is crispy. Despite the fact that I threw it in the microwave. Um, yeah, it's really nice. So I would give the sausage roll an instant 5 out of 5 stars. It's just, even the pastry is lovely. Now I'm going to add my favourite HP sauce. But because I don't want it around me, I'm going to use the scissors. And... So now, I will try a bit with the brown sauce. And that's just made it oh so much better. So yeah, absolutely love it. Five out of five, perfect seasoning on the sausage, perfect pastry, five out of five stars hands down. Harry Guys is in the Highlands so I think it's from Nern upwards you can get a Harry Guys. Uh, so yeah, if you're ever close by or on a trip to the Highlands, make sure you get yourself a Harry Guy sausage roll because trust me, you'll not have a sausage roll like it. So I tried that and my blood sugar's low. What a surprise. Every time I shower, it, my blood sugar goes down and I'm like, really? Anyhow, my blood sugar is pretty low and my blood sugar is low so I thought why not have one of my new drinks I've been meaning to try. The only thing is this drink is sugar free but I guarantee my sausage roll and dream ring will definitely bring my blood sugar up. So I find this Red Bull in Tesco. It's the apricot edition sugar free and it's a Red Bull apricot and strawberry energy drink. So today I'm in the mood for an energy drink because I was up early today and it's a Saturday and being up early on a Saturday is just cruel. So I was up early at 9 a.m. and that was too early for me. So I'm pretty tired and I could do a wee energy boost. So I'm gonna review this while I'm here and try it. So let's try. So as soon as you take a drink, you're hit with apricot and then the end taste is strawberry. It's actually quite nice. The drink itself, the color is pink by the looks of it. So it looks like strawberry is quite a prominent flavor in this Red Bull. It's actually really nice and I love my strawberry type style drinks so shockingly the Red Bull the apricot edition sugar-free which is good if you're diabetic and stuff gets a 5 out of 5 stars because yes I would get it again so yeah I would buy this again and with it being sugar-free I don't have to worry about my blood sugar so yeah and what does it say about it it says red bull the apricot edition sugar-free 
niacin and vitamin B6 contribute to the reduction of tiredness and fatigue, as well as to normal energy yielding metabolism. A varied and balanced diet and a healthy lifestyle are recommended. Energy drink with sweeteners and the taste of apricot and strawberry. High caffeine content not recommended for children or pregnant or breastfeeding women. 32 mg slash 100 milliliters. So, yeah, I got that in Tesco as part of a meal deal with my chicken Caesar wrap, but that was the wrap that made me sick and I got food poisoning from it. So, yeah, at least the drink was good. So, now the Scotland and England match will be starting soon. So, I'm going to go and watch it and enjoy this sausage roll. And the next time you see me is when I'm back and I will be digging into my dream ring. So, I will see you soon. So, I'm back and the Scotland versus England rugby game. The score was 30 to Scotland, 21 to England. And Scotland won. Yes! Come on, Scotland. So, we got the Calcutta Cup. And that's been four in a row that we've beat England and got that cup. So, yeah. So I was very happy with that result. And it was a really good game. And van der Merke or something you call him. Darham van der Merke. I don't know how you pronounce it. He was outstanding. Absolutely loved watching it. But now it's time for me to try my Harry Guy dream ring. So, I'll just get it out. And I haven't had one of these in ages. So it's gonna be, taste even sweeter. So there we go. How nice does that look? And it smells so fresh too. So you've got the icing on the top got the fresh cream in the middle and you've got that nice soft whatever type of cake bread it is so yeah so now it's time to try and now it's time to try and I think I'll go for a creamy bit So, so good. I absolutely love these. So, I think, not a surprise, I'm going to give it a five out of five and this is how I like to eat them so the cream the icing the cream is super tasty the icing is lovely It basically just tastes incredible. So I would give Harry Guy Dream Ring five out of five stars. And I love them as much as I did when I was in school. And they're definitely elite. It's Harry Guy's bakery and I got this from and Harry Guy Bakery is just elite in everything they do really you can't beat the Harry Guys so so against Greg's hands Harry Guy would win hands down it's just amazing but yeah Harry Guy's dream ring five out of five stars and I definitely think I'm gonna need to get some more of them because yeah haven't had it in ages and it tastes so good so Thanks for watching and I will see you all next time and I have no idea what I'll be reviewing next but I have a feeling 
It's probably going to be my Tim Horton cereal, the apple fritter. But I will see you soon. Bye.